And let me tell you something else. If if I give you permission to get all my write-ups, see, I call the pre I can call them right now. They'll talk to me. They know me. You know, we kind of friends, man, mm -hmm. right? Me and the prison, all of them, you know. And I called them last week, and as soon as I hit, hit the zero, the operator, say, please, is that you? I said, yeah, what you doing out there? You know, they won't talk. I said, I'm doing all You know, just make, I'm calling <laughs> to see if I can get my disciplinary reports and all that. So I, I, I gave him all my info. So they told me that when you got out, served out, that all your files were sent back to central office, but you can't get it. Mm -hmm. All the videos, everything. They got everything? Everything. Videos of me, boy, you see some things on that, fights. Yeah. Now here's the most important part. When you add, I was telling my, this is how I got on is, when you add up how many times they mace me, it's over 4,500 times. 4,500 times they maced you? Yeah, in my 40 years. Then when you look at the time where they tasered me, that's up to 2,200. You look at the time, all that, when you, when you take the totality of it, and look at it from that perspective. Mm -hmm. You say, man, they tortured this brother, man. They had me in a cell on 15 while where the rats come up through the toilet. Yeah. Mm. 15 while was like that right now. I'm not telling you something that ain't documented. It's like that right now. They got their toilet like Let's say this is the toilet. Mm -hmm. Here's the toilet right here. This is a square brick wall. This is a square brick wall that comes, so when you sit on the toilet, your legs will be out like that. Cause of the big concrete uh, brick yeah. wall sitting around the toilet. Yeah. So I said, I, I'm not sitting on the toilet anyway cause the toilet is green and molded, right? All them toilets, every toilet down there, even to this day. And so I'm sitting in there. I heard the water splashing. Okay. Man, I seen that rat come up through that toilet. I started hollering at first, car. They come down there. Oh, that's somebody keep you company, please. Jesus. You know, they're nasty like that, right? And so when I get fed, I take my food tray, and I go, mm. throw it out there in the hall, and I watch them come out from under my bed, go out there, and they eat so quick, they set up on the lane and go, that's how quick go, a wreck. I said, yeah. good God. I didn't think they would eat like that, and they big. And when you stomp your feet at them, they'll hump up on you, right? So, but one day they got me in the bed mood. I'm sitting there cussing these girls because, you know, I'm always fighting them and stuff. So I said, yeah, kiss my... And one of them crawled out from under the, the thing. I just reached out and grabbed him. Beat his head all over the wall, smashed it. I said, come here, I'm sick of y'all. And I dabbed up under the bed. I got bit by two, three of them. And grabbed them and just broke their necks and all this stuff. I'm sick of them. I'm ready to just go out and out, right? Yeah. Man, I've been through so much stuff. Look, that's crazy. But, but, but brother, here's one thing I want, want you, I want to tell you. And I'm glad that you got her. Mm -hmm. And you ain't doing all this crazy stuff out here. I want you to ask me some questions. Cause right now, man, I can tell you so much stuff about, I don't know if I'm- Please, this is not gonna be the last time that you and I talk. Right. So I'm not in a rush. I just want you to express what you yeah. wanna say. Yeah, so here, here's what I wanna tell people. This is the main thing I want to express. I was curious, I said, why did they give me parole? That's what I was, that's what I'm curious Man, I about. went up for, listen, I'm trying to tell you, see, I'm telling you the stories 
about, now check this out. Remember I told you about Ward? There was a guard in there. His name was Ronnie Youngblood. Uh-huh. All the guards looked up to him. Everybody, he's going to be the next Ward and all this stuff. He did something to me. I told his inmates, I don't care how long it takes, and I told him, I'm going to get you, bud. <laughs> Yo, when, when Fleet said, I'm going to get you, that's like a death sentence. Three years later. <laughs> give me, I'm going to quit my job right now. Yeah, bro. three years later. I'm on my way going home, getting ready to serve out my sentence. And you don't, even, you don't, you don't forget nothing. I didn't give a I said, they said, man, go home, man. What's wrong with you, nigga? You institution. I said, nigga, I ain't institutionalized. I said, first of all, stay out of my business. <laughs> ain't got nothing to do with you. I'm going to get it. <laughs> so I took a five-gallon bucket of bleach, and I boiled it for about four hours. And when he got in front of me, I went boosh. Everything fell off. <laughs> I'm, I'm literally telling you, his, his mouth, just, everything melted. So they said, they're going to kill you. I said, well, I'm ready. I had a homemade knife and a real knife. Mm. So my door went open. <laughs> Boom. I said, here they come. I stepped out in the hallway, man. I told all the inmates, I said, I'll see y'all in hell, bro. I'm out here, I said, come on, whores, all that old stuff. When they came around that corner, they had a dog. First time I ever seen a dog in the prison, a wolf. That man took that thing off and said, kill him. That thing running down the hall like that, and I'm just standing. I said, man, what are you standing here, nigga? I ran and I grabbed my mattress off the bed, right? And trying to hold it, that thing came in that door. <laughs> And I'm holding him, then here come another rock weather. Mm. He jumped, he tried to jump over the match, so I had to jump off the floor onto the bed, and I'm in a corner now, right? I'm trying to stop him from getting me. Then the guard ran in, I took his billy club, and was trying to hit my knuckles, make me drop the mattress. And then that same thing. Mm. A knife stuck me, that was over. When I pulled that knife out, I hit that dog about three times and he went over by the toilet. Then I, I killed the other one. Mm. The guard, when he seen the weapon, he ran. So so they let the dogs out and then the dogs died. Yeah, I took him, pulled him out of my cell by his two legs. I said, take it, son of a bitch. So threw him down the hall and it hurt his buddy. <laughs> so then... <laughs> <laughs> the